Hi all, this is going to be our last couple of lessons now on protest. Now this lesson should take us a good two lessons, possibly three lessons to complete all this work. We're going to be creating a discussion text on what was the most important protest in British history. Okay, now the way that we're going to do this is we've studied these five protests. Now you are more than welcome to go and research some of your own protests if you would like to do so. A couple of things you could look at perhaps is some of the earlier coal strikes like in 1926. You could look at the Greenham Common Peace Camp if you're interested in particular in women protesting. That might be quite a nice one. It's totally up to you. You can go and research your own if you want to. But these are the five that we've done. Remember, we're looking at British protest. OK, so how are we going to do this? Well, in your introduction, you're going to set the scene. Give me some background information. You're going to pick three of the three of the protests, by the way. So give me some background information on all three protests. OK, they've got to be in chronological order as well. So these are them in chronological order just to help you. OK. Then you're going to restate the question. So what was the most important of these protests? And then you're going to say, I will answer this by analysing and evaluating three different protests um, um, and come into a conclusion about which one was the most important. OK, so main paragraphs. This, you're going to have three paragraphs, one protest per paragraph. OK, pick a paragraph, um, pick a protest, three protests you think are important. Write a paragraph on each one, ranking them from least important to most important. So say you were going to do um, the hunger marches, the suffragettes and the chartists. OK, perhaps you might say um, the chartists were a very important protest. However, I believe they were the least important of um, of the three that I'm looking at. The reasons they were important are because and you'd give me some reasons that they were important. However, they weren't as important as others because and why why do they not quite fit the bill for what you're looking to do? More important than the Chartists were, and then you'd pick the next one. This was important because, but not quite as important because of this. The most important one, I believe, and then you're going to sort of bring it home to me. Which one do you think is the most important? Why is it more important than the others? Why is it, why is it the most important one? OK, and then your conclusion, sum up all the three protests again and answer the question in a sentence. So it is my belief that such and such is the most important protest of the 20th century. If you would like to get some extra marks, like I said, you can do your own research, you can research your own protests. OK, um, this is very, very, very similar to the Jack the Ripper, Jack the Ripper essay, that, essay that you did at the start of the year. So use that to help you as well. You rank order in your um, protests. OK, you only have to pick three or if you want, you can swap one of your own in for one of those. OK. Um, so that's what you're going to be doing over the next couple of lessons. We'll be online to help you if you need. But I would like you to do this independently. You're more than welcome to do extra research on these things. Go ahead. Make sure that you don't plagiarise, though. You're not just copying and pasting from a website. You're putting it into your own words. You're researching. You're discovering new things. Feel free to go and research any of these things here. OK. I'm going to let you go off and do that now. Thank you very much.